Invicare's toileting slings are designed to work with Invicare full body lifts, the Reliant 450, Reliant 600, and Jasmine. They're designed for easy placement and removal. Always check with a physician before selecting a sling. The Reliant toileting slings are designed for toileting residents who have full head and neck control. The Dress High toileting sling has a head support section. Both designs allow the caregiver access to the patient's clothing. They provide definite visual cues so that you're able to tell the inside from the outside of the sling. The inside is smooth and contains a waist belt, while the outside has sewn on labeling information and a reinforced grab handle to assist the caregiver in positioning the resident. Make sure the handle is always away from the resident's body. Invicare toileting slings are constructed of durable materials that resist deterioration from moisture and laundering. They are constructed of a unique fully padded fabric that forms a soft yet supportive surface. The soft lining helps prevent sliding for comfort and skin protection. And its stretch resistant character helps them hold their shape for superior comfort and ease of positioning. Toileting slings attach to the lift with either four or six straps for easy positioning. They're reinforced at all points of attachment for safety. Each strap has a series of color-coded loops sewn into them. This feature allows the caregiver to situate the resident in a variety of positions from full recline to full upright. Sizes are indicated on the labels and by the outer binding color. Refer to the sling chart for dimensions. Check the weight capacity of the lift and sling. Do not exceed the lowest weight capacity of either item. Although one lift will work for most residents, it's recommended that each resident be issued their own individual sling that conforms to their weight, medical condition, and type of transfer that will be performed. Before you attempt any kind of lift, make sure that you understand the resident's limitations and their ability to assist with the transfer. It's a good idea to communicate with the resident throughout the process. Let them know about each step before you perform it so that the resident is comfortable, relaxed, and can help you in any way that they can. If you explain each step as you work through it, your resident will learn the routine and become comfortable with it. Watch as a toileting sling is used with a resident seated in a wheelchair. Before performing the lift, engage the wheel locks on the wheelchair. Move the front riggings out of the way. Okay, Mr. Rampy, we're gonna go lean the resident the forward in the chair. Could you lean forward for me? Okay. Position the sling on the resident. Take the sling and slide it behind the resident with the smooth surface against the resident's body and the grab handles outside. The sling should be positioned under the resident's arms and at the base of the spine. Make sure it is straight and parallel to the patient's shoulders. The labels will be at the top of the sling. Position the straps as far forward in the seat as possible. Lean the resident back into the wheelchair. Fasten the waist belt and adjust it until it is snug and comfortable. Lift one of the resident's legs. Reach under and pull the sling out until it's just behind the resident's knee, about three inches. Repeat the procedure for the other leg. Be sure that the sling is clear of the wheelchair's front corners. Position the lift so it's over the wheelchair. Position the swivel bar so that it's parallel with the resident's shoulders for proper attachment. Lower the boom so you can attach the sling to the swivel bar. Lock the rear casters to secure the lift. Then attach the sling. First, attach the straps that are by the resident's legs to the front of the swivel bar. Attach the top straps securely to the swivel bar hooks that are closest to the resident. Again, making sure you use the same color straps for both sides. 
Next, attach the center straps to the swivel bar. Unlock the rear casters. Press the up button on the hand pendant to elevate the swivel bar and put a slight amount of tension on the sling. Double check to make sure that all sling straps are properly attached to the swivel bar. If they are not, lower the sling and fix them. Start the transfer. Press the up button on the hand pendant until the resident rises to a point just above the wheelchair. During the transfer, the other caregiver can use the sling handles to maneuver the resident. 